back to the black electorate. I'm down a strawberry back in a new wig with the edges sewed separately. After our month hiatus, a few people have joined the black ticket and today we will discuss them. First, we have Be Gone. Be Gone is a D-list celebrity and the D stands for dumpster fire trash, which is likely where she gets her hot takes. In just the month of June, Be Gone exposed herself as a classist and a fraud and we realized that she's a part of the asterisk party, which is the party for people who exceptionalize only certain parts of blackness instead of standing with it in all genders and all economic backgrounds. Yet, Be Gone is not alone in her coonery and buffoonery. She is joined by Terry Hughes, a member of the Black Pander Party. This week, Hughes tweeted that we should not turn Black Lives Matter into Black Lives Better. But if we're keeping it to Virgil's, Hughes still thinks he's on a set of white chicks. Speaking of Virgil's, Virgil a troll gained some animosity when he released a Windows 7 version of the album cover for the posthumous album by Pop Smoke coming out tomorrow. After he released this album cover, we realized that he is Mr. Krabs in a human form, and this is the second time that he's shown us this. Previously, he only donated $50 to the Black Lives Matter movement, despite having a $3 million net worth. All in all, there is a lot of coonery and buffoonery going on in the Twitter sphere. To unpack how this might impact Black love, we will bring back Felicia Gray. That's next time on The Black Electorate. With the BNN, I'm Donna Strawberry. <laughs>